Hey everyone, in this video, I'm gonna go over the Salesforce Certified Associate Exam Guide. To save you time, I'm not gonna read the entire guide. However, I do recommend that you review the entire exam guide on your own time. This video is intended to provide a brief overview of the exam. This exam is designed for people that are new to Salesforce and are interested in starting a career in the Salesforce ecosystem. Prior to the creation of this exam, the Salesforce admin exam used to be considered the entry-level certification that most aspiring Salesforce professionals would pursue as their first cert. But this exam is now the recommended prerequisite to the admin exam. Then we jump down to the exam outline section. This exam covers the following topics. Salesforce ecosystem, which makes up 32% of the exam. Navigation, which makes up 28% of the exam. Data model, which makes up 25% of the exam. And finally, reports and dashboards, which makes up 15% of the exam. There are many resources available to study for this exam, but I always recommend free resources whenever possible. That being said, I recommend the following free resources that I believe will help you pass the exam. First off, I would sign up for a free Trailhead account. You can do so by visiting trailhead.salesforce.com. I'll provide that link in the video description below. After signing up for a free Trailhead account, I recommend navigating to the trail mix that Salesforce has put together for this exam called Prepare for Your Salesforce Associate Credential. A trail mix is just a term that Salesforce uses to describe a group of trailhead modules. I'm going to quickly show you where this trail mix is. So if you signed up for a trailhead account, what you're going to want to first do is navigate to the Credentials tab and then underneath it, click Certifications. From here, we're going to click on the Salesforce Associate link at the top. As you can see, it gives a brief about the exam section with the link to the exam guide that we just were on. If we scroll down to the study and prepare section, you'll see the trail mix that I was referring to, prepare for your Salesforce associate credential. If we click on that, you'll first see that you can follow this trail, which I recommend that you do. I also recommend bookmarking this page so it saves you the time when you're going through your studies. If you scroll down through this trail mix, you'll see the various trailhead modules that make up certain sections of the exam, such as Salesforce ecosystem. If we navigate back to the previous page, as you can see in this upper right-hand corner, the entire trail mix is expected to take you 34 hours to complete. That's a pretty large amount of time. The good thing is it's not necessary to complete the entire trail mix in order to pass the exam. I'm gonna be releasing videos that go over the exam topics in a fraction of this time. In addition to the videos that I create, there's also this trailhead module called Salesforce Associate Certification Prep. As you can see, it's only 50 minutes long. Essentially, this module gives a high-level overview of each of the exam topic sections. So my recommendation is to use a combination of the three resources that I just mentioned, the trail mix, my videos, and the Salesforce Associate Certification Prep module. If we navigate back to the exam guide, the last thing that I wanted to highlight from the exam guide were some additional details about the exam. The exam has a total of 40 questions with a passing score of 62%. With Salesforce exams, you receive the results immediately after submitting the exam. It costs 75 USD to take the exam and retaking the exam is free. Lastly, you can take the exam at a testing center or online. Both testing methods are given in a proctored environment. So that's all I have for this video. I hope my videos for this exam provide value and help you pass your first Salesforce cert. Thank you all for watching today and I'll see you in the next video.